About a week ago, I had one of the most enjoyable and happy experiences I've ever had. And it wasn't like I was playing video games or eating junk food or anything like that. It was actually a pretty productive thing I was doing that was just so, so enjoyable. And it gave me the greatest feeling ever. And I'm gonna explain to you what it is now. And all I'm gonna ask of you bros is simply just hear what I have to say and then go and comment to try and prove me wrong that this isn't the greatest feeling in the world. Because I can guarantee you, this is by far the greatest feeling in the world you can possibly have. Now, about a week ago, I had an incredibly productive day. I woke up at half four, I got loads of business work done. I got, actually, I got two sales in my business, quick $300 that morning. If you don't already know, I'm, I'm 15, I'm making about $2,000 a month, just <laughs> quick flex lol. After I did my business work, I had a cold shower. I then worked out before school. I then had a half decent day at school, the best type of day you can have at school. Obviously, school's never that good. I came home from school, I ran 10 kilometers. I got home, went on a few calls with some of my clients, and then, it was time for dinner. And so I brought my dinner up to my room because like my family wasn't eating at the same time. I was like eating at a different time for my family for some reason. So I brought my dinner up to my room. I put it down on my desk. I opened up the new like hardest geezer video. So if you don't know, the, the, the guy that's like running across Africa, I really, really love watching his videos. He's ended them now, but when they were coming out, I really, really loved watching them. So I opened up his newest video. I sat down and I just started eating my big dinner of pork, watching his video, feeling so accomplished and so fulfilled. You see, the greatest possible feeling that I believe you can have is simply just being fulfilled, having a really, really good productive day, getting so much done, and then you're sitting down to enjoy yourself, feeling fulfilled. I believe that is the greatest possible feeling you can have because it makes you feel fulfilled. If you're feeling fulfilled, it basically just means you don't feel the need to have any more. And if you don't feel the need to have any more than you already have, it's like level a thousand gratitude and you just feel so grateful for everything and you just feel so happy and you're always in just such a good mood when you feel fulfilled. Uh, so right now, bro, I'm gonna go tell you to comment. I never ever tell you to comment, but go comment right now and just tell me. What is better? What is a better feeling than feeling fulfilled? Because I almost guarantee there is not a single feeling that will feel fulfilled and I will debate with you in the comments. Now the only negative, the only downside about like having this feeling, about getting this feeling is the fact that you have to be ultra productive and you have to be like super top level productive and have a really, really good day to actually start to feel it. I'm 10 times as productive as the average guy. The average guy, maybe he, only wakes up before school, he goes to school, he comes back from school, he goes to the gym for a bit, has like a meh workout, then he comes home, watches some YouTube and goes to Bed. That's like a half, a, a, an average day for someone my age. Now, an average day for me is like wake up at five, do some work in my business, sometimes work out before school, not usually though, have my cold shower, go to school, come back, go for a big run, usually just five kilometers a day, that's what I do. Then I work out and then I'll have dinner with my family and then I'll come up and go to bed. That'll be a pretty good day for me. And obviously, my day is much, much more productive than like the, the, the average guy's day, obviously. Now, if the average guy, if he had like my day, if that makes sense, if he was as productive as I am in his average day, he will feel like so fulfilled. He'll so feel like, feel so, so good about himself. Yeah, I don't feel the same way every single day and that's because I'm quite used to being this productive. And so for me, I have to be even more productive. I would have to have a day like I described in the story earlier. Now, here's the catch. If you keep having days, like really, really top level productive days, then eventually you'll get used to that and that become your baseline. Yeah, and then you'll have to have even more productive days. And eventually it'll get to a point when you can't even be more productive and you'll no longer feel fulfilled because it'll be impossible to become more productive. That's a pretty weird concept to explain, but I hope you understand that the only way you actually get fulfillment is just by being better than you currently are. Now being productive actually comes with another massive upside and that's that you actually feel really, really happy when you are being productive. Just think about this, just actually like properly think about this now. <clears throat> Don't treat this video like any other video on YouTube, okay? Treat this video differently because this video is different. I am different from most other self-improvement YouTubers, okay? So just really listen to what I'm about to say and like make sure you remember it. And that's that when you are actually being productive and when you are doing the good things that you know you are supposed to be doing, you actually feel better while doing those things than when you are doing the bad things. Just imagine this. Let's say you're on the, you're at the gym working out or you're getting some like really, really good business work done, whatever. Yeah, let's say you're being super productive, getting the stuff you really need to get done and you're getting it done. Now compare that moment with, I don't know, when you're just like scrolling on YouTube or something like that. Which one is better? Is it the one where you're being productive or the one where you're scrolling on YouTube? Which one do you enjoy more? Obviously it's the being productive on business, isn't it? Being productive, going to the gym. You actually enjoy it in the moment more when you're being productive. And that's simply because you just mentally know you are doing the right thing and you can, you can be proud of yourself. When you're doing the right thing, you can respect yourself. You can have a level of respect for, for yourself. You can, you can have self-love when you're doing the right things yet. When you are doing the bad things, when you're scrolling on YouTube or doing any of that bullshit, you no longer have any self-love and you no longer feel very good about yourself. And so just realize this, that when you are actually doing the hard things, the productive things, you actually feel better. So next time you're 
like contemplating in your mind whether you should do the hard thing or the easy thing, the good thing or the bad thing, just realize that if you actually do the good hard thing, you will feel better while doing it. And not only will, will you feel better while doing it, you'll feel so much better after doing it. Now, obviously making progress on business, making money online, doing all this stuff, it's a real, real challenge for basically everyone and including you. And honestly, bro, if you haven't made any progress in business already, I have empathy for you. And if you already have made like progress in your business, I respect you, bro. Business, making money online, it will really bring you to a beautiful place. And if you actually make progress in it and if you become successful with it, then you will live because if you don't, if you don't become successful in business and if you just stay like a normal person, go down the nine to five route, you are gonna absolutely hate your life, aren't you? And I'm sure you already know this, bro. And I'm just saying now, if you do not make any progress in business, if you do not start making money online and actually making, being successful, actually getting ahead of everyone else, you're gonna end up hating your life. And now bro, I have an offer to make you and that's that I will help you to start making money online. Now, all I'm gonna tell you to do is just simply just go click that top link in the description because I will change your life with that bro. I hope this video serves you well. Subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next one.